Good morning, everybody. It's the next day. We just got back from Seaza, the fruit and vegetable distribution center. Here's what we got. I got 14 coconuts, two per day. We got a big old bag of tangerines. They look pretty good. I got a box of custard apples. I got a box of pineapples, so did Anna. And I got four boxes of custard apples. Six. Six boxes? Okay, you got five, because I got one. Oh, damn it. They look beautiful. Just about ready to eat. And I got 19 coconuts or something. And we got five watermelons. No, you got six. Here's my box. That's what I'm saying. I've got okay, six. she did get six boxes of custard apples. Those are from last week, Cherimoyas. Anything else in there? I don't have to do any heavy lifting today because my back, I'm super sore from just walking around yesterday. Boom. Today we are going to go to the organic market, I think. We'll see Anna's brother's house. Uh, he's remodeling it. Then we're going to go to a vegan bazaar, little vegan festival sort of deal. Check out our limes, yo. Mmm. These are called pink limes. They turn orange and they're super delicious. And check out our lemons. These are like really interesting lemons. These lemons are a different kind of lemon. Not very sweet and they are not sour at all either. They're a very interesting variety of lemon. The lemon flavor but no sweetness and no acidity. Well, a little bit of sweetness. Check these bad boys out, looking good. I ate some solid food yesterday, a watermelon, and I'm gonna roll that clip now. I'm gonna take my first bite of solid food in seven days. I'm gonna go right for the middle because that is always the sweetest part. Oh my goodness. It's like it's sweeter than honey. It probably has like half the sugar content than honey does. But because I've been fasting for so long and my taste buds are so like cleaned out and sensitive, it hits you like a bomb. It's not just like a sensation you feel on your tongue, it like goes everywhere. It's crazy. This is so good. All right, one more bite, one more bite. Mmm. It's like, it's like nectar, pure nectar. Nectar from the gods. Add on his brother's house, doing some construction. They are, I'm just taking it easy. I am gonna fly the drone. And maybe eat some custard apples. Mango, I already ate like 12 oranges. He's got a lot of interesting stuff. <laughs> Listening to some postal service. It's gonna be a good day. Part of the noise, I'm gonna bust open a custard apple because it is obviously ready. If you've never had one of these, you are missing out. It's just a fact. I have hiccups. Anytime I eat after I've fasted, I, I get hiccups. It's kind of strange, but I think I remember happening <laughs> in my last fast. So here we go. They split open when they're ready. They are amazing. You just open them up like that. If anybody knows how to get rid of hiccups, let me know. And then boom, just throw a spoon in there and you've got a mouthful of amazingness. Mm. It's like really smooth, it's like almost creamy, but there's no fat, or very little fat. So good. I got a box of 10 of these for $10, not too bad. Here in Brazil it is called Fruto do Congi, which means the Count's Fruit. It's fruit for royalty, basically. There's like tons of seeds. Pretty much every one of these little morsels here has a seed in it. Seed in it. These hiccups are really annoying, but I hope they go away soon. If you know why I'm getting hiccups after fasting, let me know. I've done a little bit of research and nobody seems to know. But it is a common thing. You should also probably try to describe the flavor. It's almost like a very subtle vanilla-y, almost like bubble gum. There's a definite bubble gum. There's a bubble gum flavor in there for sure. And there's definitely some like fruity notes. 
I don't know, man. You just gotta try it. It's in the chair Moya family, soursop family. But they're awesome. Try it out. Salad's like I like my soup. Soupy. 